Logitech has just announced a new key light and a new XLR microphone, and it looks super cool. But get your wallet out because it's expensive. Anyways, guys, I'm Blaze2K. Please smash the like, hit the subscribe, and click the bell icon for more tech and gaming content. Anyways, let's get into it and let's talk about the new Lytra Beam and the XLR microphone. Let's get into it. So guys, Logitech are really branching out into game streaming equipment, um, kind of like Elgato, right? I've got an Elgato Stream Deck here. I've even got an Elgato microphone. I forgot the name of it, but it's pretty cool. Uh, let me hold up, hold it up. I'm actually using it right now to record this video. So it's my, this is my other microphone, the one that I have clipped onto my head, um, has been a little bit choppy lately. If you've been watching my videos, you're probably here, right? Um, so yeah, they're they're branching out. They've released a new light. Alt Lytra Beam LED streaming key light with TrueSoft, which is like I'm guessing allows you to adjust the color temperature of it or the the white balance, um, and a blue sonar microphone, and they're a little bit pricey. Now I'm not up to date on on microphone technology. XLR is something I've heard a lot about, and I think that's what like professional professional people use. It's like a specific input i think or output for your microphone and it allows you to put it into like a preamp and stuff and like really have crispy audio quality um i'm never i'm not a massive tech geek when it comes to microphone stuff um but i know a lot of big streamers and youtube creators um use xlr microphones and i've yet to try it myself maybe i'd need to try it because my microphone experience has been pretty crappy i'll be honest um but they're wanting 350 dollars for it it looks pretty cool we'll talk about the specs and stuff it does and the lytra beam for 99.99 now I am, I'm kind of interested in this a little bit, but I kind of like, I just use the Philips U bulb in front of me. See, <laughs> that's what I use for my lighting. And I like being colored, you know, I like being colorful in videos. I look, even, I look like a tomato, but I like, I like it. I like the, I can change the color, the color theme in my room. I don't like just having a white light light um, thingy on me because I am extremely pale. All right. I'd rather be pink than pale. Anyways, um, so Logitech's new key light could almost pass for a regular desk lamp. Logitech is announcing the Lytra Beam alongside the new XLR microphone today. Logitech is introducing a new key light for streamers with a low profile design that almost makes it look like a regular desk lamp. Cool. Um, rather than using a circular design like Elgato's popular ring light, you've probably seen these ring lights. In fact, I've even got one up here in my video. You can probably see it up there, right? <laughs> it's a cheap one on Amazon. Don't, don't hate on me, okay? But it was only like 20, 30 bucks. Um, so... Yeah, Elgato sells their ring light. $200 for that one, though. It's a little bit pricey, isn't it? But it looks a lot more sturdy than the one I got on Amazon. N no lie. Does, does, does their ring light allow you to change the color? Does it have full RGB? It doesn't. Uh, oh, $200 for just a white ring light. No, thank you. Um, anyways, um, so yeah. Um, the new Lytra Beam has a long, thin shape, so it just clip, it goes behind your monitor and shines down, which is kind of cool. I'm a little bit worried about the reflection, though, possibly, reflecting on the screen. I don't know. Um, so the PC accessory manufacturer is announcing the light alongside a new $349 XLR microphone called the Blue Sonar. I can see the Lytra Beam's low-profile form factor appealing to anyone who's streaming, podcasting, or making video calls in a communal part of their home. Although devices like Elgato's Ring Light are, an ex are excellent at keeping you eliminated while broadcasting, they can take up a lot of space. In contrast, the Lytra Beam can be aligned neatly with the top of your monitor or pointed down at the desk to act as a traditional desk lamp when you're not streaming. Now, I've been wanting to get into book reading a lot more lately, so ooh, it's tempting for 100 bucks but it's better than 200 bucks that elgato are charging um i wouldn't i wouldn't mind doing a little bit of reading at my desk oh look at that you can put it up on a little stand like that and have it eat like bend over like that that's really cool um the light room itself has an on and off button as well as hardware controls for brightness and color temperature with the latter adjustable between a relatively warm 2700k and a super cool 6500k so that it does let you change your color temperature you can be sort of yellowy warm or you can be really coolly blue um color temp can also be changed for your software using logitech's g hub desktop app connection options include usb bluetooth and there's cable management built into its stand for the usb cable note that there's no built-in battery so you're going to need to plug the beam's usb cable in for power regardless of how it's connected to a computer um, and they're also announcing the xlr microphone the 
Blue Sona. It's a dynamic microphone with a super cardioid pickup pattern, which means it needs to be positioned around 10 centimeters from your mouth. Oh, geez. Um, for optimal sound, according to Logitech's Julian Garros. But it shouldn't pick up much in the way of keyboard clacking or, or other background noises. The mic's integrated windscreen, the foam cover that reduces the popping sounds, is available in red or grey, attaches magnetically, and is easily removable while the body comes in grey or off-white. Um, though the Blue Sona is equipped with these high quality of life features, it's not an all-in-one package. Logitech says it's built-in preamp with a gain boost of 25 de decibels means you shouldn't need an external mic booster. You'll still need an audio interface to connect this XLR microphone to a computer. Um, so you will still need an audio interface. Um, it doesn't come with a stand. Instead, you'll get a small swivel mount that's designed to attach to a standard mic arm. It does look pretty cool. I don't know if I'm going to go for like a, a white and orange one, though. I think I'd probably go for black because I just like black everything, dude. Black, white, that's... It's still pricey though, isn't it? It's pricey. Um, so yeah, um, the Lytra Bay and Blue Sona are available starting today across the US, Canada, and select European countries, including the UK. Lytra Bay costs ninety nine, which it looks sorry. It's an expensive lamp. <laughs> well, the Blue Sona costs about three hundred and fifty, and you will need an external, um, well, an audio interface to connect this XLR microphone to a computer. So. It doesn't include everything you need, um, including the, like the stand and stuff to put it on. But there we go, guys. New tech for gamers and streamers and video content creators um, coming from Logitech, of all people. And like I said, I'm a massive fan of Logitech, except for the new game in hand deal they just announced. That is a piece of crap. For $300, in fact, it was $350, it turns out. I did a video just before this one talking about the $300 Logitech G, G game in hand deal. Go check it out on my channel. And I said it was $300 because Kotaku lied. It turns out it was $350, which makes it even an even worse deal. But yeah, I do like Logitech things. I've got a Logitech keyboard here. I love it. I've got a Logitech gaming mouse here. I've had since 2015. Love it also. And um, I do love things Logitech. So Logitech. You're getting a little bit pricey, Logitech, but um, I am interested by this new microphone in light, so stay tuned. I might buy it. Who knows? Anyways, guys, I'm Blaze2K. Okay. Please leave a like down below. It helps the algorithm out, um, and I'll see you in a future video. I'll be streaming every day at uh, 3 p.m. Eastern at 2 p.m. Central, and I believe that is 12 p.m. Pacific. I don't know my time zones, but I'll be streaming on Twitch.tv. Link in the description for my Twitch and YouTube. I'll also tweet it out on Twitter beforehand over on my Twitter account, also in the description. Go check the description for all the links you need for everything me. <laughs> Anyways, guys, have a wonderful day. I love you, and I appreciate you. Um, have a wonderful Thursday. Baby Eurus is high. Goodbye.